Um, quick disclaimer, guys. Before we get this video started, I just wanted to state that I'm not showing off in this video. I don't flex on you guys. I don't want to show, show off and just be like, hey, guys, look all the nice things I have. I want to show off these things to you guys. I, wanna, I want you guys to see the things that I have because I think that you guys deserve to know what I use to make my videos. That being said, let's get this video started, shall we? <laughs> What's going on guys, it's Cynthius, and today we're going to be going through all of the game consoles, systems, and games that I happen to own, so let's get into it. We're going to start out with a classic. This is my PlayStation 2 Slim. It's a really nice console and it plays a lot of great games. You can even mod it to play some emulators. If you ever get the chance to buy a PlayStation 2, I recommend the Slim. It's a great console. And of course, next we have the most widely known console on the planet, the Xbox 360. Once again, plays a lot of great games. The graphics are really nice. The console runs really well. But unfortunately, mine has some problems with the fan. I'd like to get it fixed, but I'm afraid they don't do that anymore, so... I'm kind of just stuck with a slightly broken console, but at least it won't get red ranked, am I right? And here we have, in my opinion, Nintendo's best console, the GameCube. This was really underrated, but it's still a really nice console, it's compact, and you can take it anywhere on the go. It's really nice, and I think you should buy it if you get the money. Mine is actually one of the special models that has the digital out, so you can use the official component cables with it. Unfortunately, I can't get it because it's too expensive, but if I could, I'd definitely do it. This is a nice console, and you should buy it. And here we have the GameCube's brother, the Wii. Of course, this was Nintendo's best-selling console at the time, but unfortunately I don't have many games for it, and it kind of just sits as one of those sad consoles that tried to use motion controls but failed. I'd only use this to play component GameCube games, as the component cables for the Wii are much better. And here we have my most unloved console, the Nintendo 64, and right here you can see why. I bought Superman 64 for it, so... Uh, it's probably gonna go in the garbage. And here we have one of my most favorite Nintendo consoles, the Nintendo Entertainment System. Ah, uh, what a classic. Unfortunately, this is the only game I have for it, Super Mario Bros. and Duck Hunt. But I can't even play it because I don't have a controller for it. All it has is a zapper, so yeah. Maybe soon I might be able to play it, but until I get some controllers, it kind of just sits there as a sad middle ground. And of course, we have the Beast my PC. And here we have my three monitors. That one's not working at the moment. I don't have the right adapter. This one's not too special. Just new 2K monitor. It's got a new camera on top of it. And this is an old monitor from my old Windows 7 PC. Pretty nice, I must say. But I don't get to use them much. And here we got my little drawer full of controllers, headsets, basically anything that I might need. It's kind of a mess, but that's to be expected. There's wires everywhere, so yeah, you got my Xbox headset, Wii controllers, you know, simple stuff. And here we got my wires and audio cables, that sorts of thing. We got like chargers, you know, simple stuff. And down here we have all of my handhelds. Now, we'll start out with my original Game Boy. I actually bought this. The speaker does not work, unfortunately, and the data cable doesn't come out. Next, we got this old thing. Um, this is my Nintendo DSi XL. Played a lot on this thing. It's a ton of fun. Not much to say there. 
And here we have my Indigo Game Boy Color. I know it looks blue, but it's Indigo, and the camera doesn't make it look right. It's really nice. It's helped me through a lot of times. I've played this so much. It's truly a warrior. And next, what we have is my Sony PlayStation Portable. This thing is great. I love it so much. It's provided me with so many hours of entertainment. This thing, that's, that's trampled off for such a long time. Here we have my PlayStation Portable games. We have 20X Underground 2 Remix, Star Wars Battlefront Elite Squadron, 20X Project A, and Little Big Planet. Here we have my assortment of games. It's mostly PC games, PlayStation 2 games, Xbox 360 games. Down here we also have PlayStation 2 games, um, GameCube games, and my ginormous DS collection, along with some PlayStation games and some old PC titles. Down here is mostly Wii titles. Um, and we also have a few Xbox 360s games down there not much to say up here we have my six Game Boy games game um pokemon red pokemon blue um super mario land 2 pac-man mickey's racing adventure and rayman 2 those last two games are on the game boy color here are my pc peripherals we have my um logitech mouse and my dell keyboard as well as my new xlr mic that i'm talking to right now pop filter needs a sound we also have another microphone up here and a ps4 controller but anyways guys that's my collection of electronics i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want to see more videos like this one make sure you leave a like a comment and a subscribe more videos about the cod let's play and the indiana jones game let's play are coming out soon don't worry they're coming out i'm working on them i just i've had some trouble with school lately and i've had to get some things done but anyways enough excuses I'm signing off, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.